Once we've finished our design in PVCAD and we've imported topography as well as pier heights, we can come up to the top of the PVCAD ribbon and select PV Cyst. This is going to create three files for us that we can then use directly in PV Cyst. Um, the first one is a project file and this includes address project information. The second one is a media file that includes weather information. And then most notably, we have um, the shadings file, and that will include 3D shading information. Going into a view where we can see these files side by side, both the files, uh, the files we created in PVCAD Mega on the right hand side, and then the files on the left hand side from our PVSYST programming, we're going to take the contents of each file and then um, just port them directly over to the corresponding folder in PVSYS so we can see on the PVSYS side we also have a project, media, and shadings folder as well. Once all of those files are placed in, we can go back into PVSYS and continue continue to fill in the rest of our project information. Um, and once that's all good to go, we're just going to go to the construction plan view so you can actually see that 3D shade scene that we imported directly in PVSYS itself. And so here you can actually see that 3D shade scene from PVCAD now in PVSYST.